I've said that I'm lucky through this and I am probably one of the luckiest people in the dance industry. I've had a lot of moments in time where I've got to ex gotten to experience so many different things and I've had some, uh, a lot of what I felt at the moment was an ultimate moment of dance fashion. Uh, the first time I saw a dress on the dance floor that I had designed at Blackpool, I, I literally cried like a small child. Um, and now I have lots of dresses that dance at Blackpool, but I, I think I probably said to 15 people around me, that's my dress on the dance floor. And uh, I know they probably thought that was really strange that, that an American woman is like, that's my dress. But that for me is the ultimate ballroom in a way. Uh, and since then, of course, I've had a lot of champions and I've had dressed so many great, great girls and guys. Um, and I've dressed so many students. And I think that uh, in terms of being proud of what I do, I'm, I'm proud of every dress that goes out the door that I know is what it set out to be. Uh, when I have a customer text me and they're twirling and they've taken a, a selfie video of themselves in their house and it's their first dance dress and they're literally crying because they're so happy. That for me, just, I, it makes me so happy. I send that video to my staff immediately to show them that this is what drives us forward. To make new students who've never had a, a custom dress, have never had that moment to put on something that was made just for them, uh, it, it's incredible. And you know, as, as a female in the United States, and for that matter, for the world, you can't really get clothes made for you anymore. This is an opportunity for you to really have what you want and to put your input into it, even with your teacher telling you that that's not what you want or that's what this is what he wants. At the same time, this is truly needs to be your experience and you get to have what you want. And that is an opportunity for me to give you a dream that you can't get anywhere else. So what is our future? What are we gonna do next? 15 years ago, I would have told you we were gonna do a whole lot of really crazy, wild, exciting things. And we did a lot of that. Our future right now is solidly based in ballroom dancing. And uh, I want to help dancers be all that they can be on the dance floor. I want to have the most innovative dresses possible. I want to have dresses that move and that work for them and that can last and can be in, in someone's closet for years to come and that they will always want to put on. And that is, um, it's not that I don't wanna do new things because every day is a new day for me, but I wanna make the best ballroom dress always. So 10 years from now, where do I see us? I see us getting better at what we do every day. Uh, and uh, who knows? I mean, will we have dresses in Europe then? Maybe, maybe not. I, I am, I won't say I'm satisfied with where we are. I will say that I am never satisfied at doing the same thing again. So I wanna be better the next day at it. Thank you.